guys, I am here to do my what I got my kids for Christmas video. If you're new around here and just clicking this for ideas, I only have one child, he's six years old, and the stuff you saw in the thumbnail is not all just for him. It is for my nieces, my nephews, my great nephew, like, I still can't believe that I am a great aunt. I don't feel old enough to be a great aunt, but it is what it is, um, and my godchildren. Um, so. It's not just for him, but I do buy a lot of things for him at Christmas, and that is because I clear and shop. Most of the stuff you're gonna see in this video was 75% to 90% off. Um, if you wanna know how I do it, I do have an older video. It's kind of long and lengthy. I will um, put it at the very end of this video when, um, you know, the, like the outro plays or whatever. Um, I'll also try to link it below. So I'm not going to get into all that, but I'm a clearance shopper and then I will ask Jackson what big gift he wants and I will buy that for him. Santa Claus did stop by in this video so you guys can see what Santa also brought him. In our family, we tell Santa to please only do three gifts and we don't ask Santa for expensive gifts. And that is because we are lucky enough to be able to give um, Jackson gifts and that enables Santa to have more time to make gifts for kids that maybe, you know, need more gifts or more expensive gifts. We don't ask Santa for expensive gifts. So um, you guys can see what Jackson asked Santa for. I can't remember if Santa left stocking stuffers. <laughs> I have not looked at the stuff yet. I'm pre-recording this intro, but we'll just find out together. But anyways, most of the stuff is 75 to 90% off. Um, and then the very last thing before we get this video kicked off is if, oh, I forgot to tell you one thing. This year, Walmart did panic me, and I had talked to some y'all in DMs on Instagram. Um, Walmart, the video I'm linking below, Walmart this year did not kick off their, their like, toy liquidation in July like usual. It happened in, like, August. I panicked in July when I wasn't seeing any toy liquidation. But Target this year, they pulled through. I've never seen Target go 90% on toys like they did. And I was able to get Jackson at like every Jurassic Park thing he didn't already have. His favorite thing in the world. All this Jurassic Park stuff for 90% off. You guys will see that in the video. Target was where I got most of my toys this year. And then there might be a few things from like a couple years ago that I maybe bought for like when it was more age appropriate. I do have like still things in my unit that are for maybe when he's older. That's like I said, that's just how I shop. Um, so to my subscribers, I'm sorry about my absence the past couple weeks. Um, I posted on here, but I'm not sure how many people see it. I'm still learning how to use like posts and stuff, but Jackson had pneumonia and we spent Halloween in the hospital. It was very scary. He got 106 fever and I couldn't bring it down with um, any fever reducers. And so we went to the hospital, they couldn't figure out what's going on, lots and lots of testing. Finally, they did x-rays and found the pneumonia. It was really scary because the hospital started like getting freaked out because they couldn't bring it down, they couldn't bring his heart rate down. It was <laughs> traumatic to say the least, but luckily we got through it. He is doing so much better, he still has a cough. They said that that would probably last for a couple months as his lungs heal, but, um, you know, about the time he finally recovered and was able to go back to school, I um, left on a bachelorette cruise to Mexico. I just got back. So it's been crazy, but I'm back and I'm very grateful to those y'all on social media, like on my Instagram that were sending prayers and well wishes and good energy towards Jackson. We really, really appreciate your, um, your prayers and your good thoughts. Anyways, let's get into this video. Okay, I thought it would be funny to show this to you guys. Last night, I tried to film this. This is how I hid everything from Jackson this morning. I tried to film this for you guys. Um, Jackson was having some issues with his cough. They said it would be a couple months before his lungs healed from the pneumonia. So I just stopped trying to film. <laughs> and now I'm going to show y'all everything I got for Christmas. It is not as pretty as it was last night because, like I said, I started filming and um, he was just struggling. And I, I really didn't want, like, I didn't want to worry about the video um, when he was coughing so much. So he's better this morning with his cough. The nights are usually the worst and he's in school. So we're going to go through everything. And it was much prettier, but it is what it is because we're going to get through it all. 
So the one thing I forgot when I was talking to you guys about earlier in the intro is that um, the Amazon also had just an amazing Prime Day. I'm going to get down on the floor. Prime Day deals. It was freaking awesome. Um, and I forgot to mention that aside from Target's awesomeness, that Prime, I woke up one morning at four during Prime sales and I got some amazing toy deals. Some of those things I've given away as birthday gifts since then, but um, let's just get into it. <laughs> okay, so this I ordered and I did not know <laughs> The store name was FU Store, so I'm probably going to take it out of the box, but it's baby teethers for the newest uh, nephew in the family. <laughs> um, this is for my great nephew. It's this really fun pack of fishing stuff for the bathtubs. There's fish. There's a net. This is still one of the things, even though Jackson's six, he loves in the bathtub. So I thought that'd be really great for my nephew. I believe I accidentally, my great nephew, I think I mixed his birthday gifts in here because he's a Thanksgiving baby. But um, since they were part of like the clearance deals, I just left them in here. This I got during a Walmart sale and it went down to like five bucks. And I was shocked because this is one of their, Jackson's all about Nerf guns. This is still available. I don't know if it's still on sale that deep. I think the last time I checked it was 10, but on Walmart. And so I actually got several of them. The rest are in storage for um, just like future birthday parties where I don't really know the kids very well. Like um, just, you know, like a good quick grab gift. So that's another thing I tend to do with my clearance shopping. Um, this is like one of their 30 $35 guns usually. And Jackson saw the ones in storage. He didn't see this because I had already pulled his Christmas stuff out. He saw the ones in storage I bought for birthday parties. He's like, oh, I need one of those. So I know he's going to be really excited. He's super into Nerf guns, which you guys will see in a minute. Okay. So here we go. Y'all remember me telling you about Jurassic Park sales? Some of this was Amazon. Some of it was Target. I'd say half and half. Amazon just cleared out, just like Target, the Jurassic World line. And I was so excited because I think I got him every single Jurassic World toy. Between like last Christmas, his birthday, and this Christmas, he's going to have all of them. And that is like his his subject of interest, his favorite thing. So he's going to be so excited. So some of these things he did pick from Target during one of the sales, but he knows he's getting it at Christmas. So this is one of the Camp Cretaceous toys. I'm not even going to try to... An Albertosaurus? I don't know. I don't know. He could tell you everything about these dinosaurs, what their name are, what they did. Like, it's just crazy. I, I don't know. He's just so smart, especially when it comes to dinosaurs. Okay, so this is a quid... He told me the name of this. Like, it's a quidiquiti something. I don't know. He says it really well. But this bird dinosaur, that was um, one of the Target sales. This was one of the Amazon Lightning deals. It was on his wish list from his birthday. Um, and he didn't get it for his birthday. And I think we got it for $4. Um, and that was like way discounted. Santa stopped by, I think I said this earlier, and he brought some of Jackson's Christmas gifts. One thing that Santa does is he always gives books with the gifts that Jackson asked for. He asked Santa for three things, and he also always puts a few books in there. So he got Jackson this light year book, and then he told me he saw this at Costco, because you know Santa shops at Costco, and he said that he just had to get it because he knows how much Jackson loves these pigeon books, the Mo Williams books. And this is one that Jackson doesn't have. So Santa said, you know, I was shopping at Costco with Miss Claus and I just had to get it for him. So those are some things that Santa got. All right. So more dinosaurs. Um, this was a Target one. This was an Amazon deal, I believe, one of the games. Because a bunch of board games went on sale during the Amazon Prime Jackson absolutely loves, 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 loves games, like board games. We have a whole closet. We do games all the time. It's his favorite thing. It's often what he picks as a reward in occupational therapy as well. So he got Operation 2. I got this. This one was Walmart clearance. Operation. Um, this is actually for my godson. It's the Endoraptor from Jurassic World. 
He said he wanted a dinosaur that would move a lot. And when my best friend told me that, I instantly thought of this Indoraptor because Jackson has it. They actually have his arms tied down, so I can't show you. This is one of the most posable, movable dinosaurs in the line, and Jackson loves it. So I went ahead and got Liam that, and it was awesome because it was like 40% off. So um, these are one of the Amazons, and these. These are for my goddaughter, Charlotte. Um, the Barbies were like $4, even for the big sets. I got her a Barbie pool during the Amazon sale. They came with a Barbie for her birthday, and I think I paid $6 for that. It is, it's just absolutely crazy. I'm definitely, next year during um, Prime Day, going to be waking up at like 3 and 4 a.m. Because they, they did Prime Day with lightning deals at that time. It was amazing. So this is something I got on clearance at Target about... Nine months ago, I just saw it walking by, um, and yeah, Jackson has these this like Imaginex sets of Jurassic World stuff, but then he also has the realistic um, ones. Here's another one. This one was a, I believe this one was one of the Target clearance. I don't know the name of this dinosaur, but now that he's not here, if they if they roar, I'll like press it or whatever, so you guys can hear. All right. This Buzz Lightyear was a clearance from Target, not Buzz, well, from the Buzz, the Lightyear movie. This is Zerg. Jackson has a ton of Buzz stuff, a ton of Toy Story stuff. He has one Zerg. It's actually up there. This is where he keeps all of, he calls his fancy Toy Story toys that he doesn't want his friends. I, I'm not kidding you guys. He says he doesn't want his friends breaking them when they come over because he is so particular and gentle about his toys. So that Zerg stays up there. But um, I saw this smaller Zerg from the movie, and I was like, you know what? I think he will love this, because he said when he saw the movie that he doesn't have enough Zerg stuff. So when I found this on clearance, I was like, perfect, and it was only like $4. Okay. Santa said that he got this for Jackson Stocking, another thing he left. This was a recent sale, and you guys, I'm telling you this now, open your Target app every single day. Till Christmas, they will be having random sales on certain things. This was one of them about two weeks ago. I, I was in my Target app to order something, and I said, oh my gosh, the Nintendos, they have select Nintendo Switch games on sale. Zelda is always like $60. I have never seen Zelda on sale, ever. And Target had it, this game that's usually $60, for $25. And I didn't plan on buying him this, but for that price, I went ahead and got it. Because Zelda, I have never seen it. It just didn't even said it rarely ever goes below $60. Um, like, so, yeah, I scooped that up. Because he loves Zelda. So now he has it. I got these two things for... Um, the new baby in the family. This is for when he's a little older during the upcoming spring and summer. And this little giraffe toy, Fisher Price. Okay. Santa brought Jackson, because this was Jackson requested, dinosaur Nerf guns when he saw Santa in Miss Sally's Kitchen, which is Country Grace. She is the photographer that does cookies with Santa. And we got to see Santa before Halloween. It was awesome. Jackson told Santa he wanted the Dino Squad Nerf guns. So Santa pulled through. He got him the um, Triceratops one, and this one is a Raptor one. And then I was told by Santa there was a killer deal at Target on them. So I got one for my godson and one for um, one of my nephews. And then this is part of the stuff Santa brought. So this, I'm going to put it over here so Santa can come get it and bring it back Christmas Eve. All right. So, um, but Santa, Santa told me about that killer deal he got on those Nerf guns and I was lucky they still had it. So over here, this is another, this one was one of the Target um, ones that Jackson picked when they had the BOGO and the clear out. So it was clear out prices on them and then they did BOGO too. I, I don't know why they were, I feel like Jurassic Park is always so popular. I was really surprised they were clearing out. This is another one. This is the Baryonyx. Jackson has been wanting this Baryonyx dinosaur for so long and it, again, clearance. It was amazing. Um, then Jackson, you guys, Jackson has a Triceratops similar to this but larger, but it doesn't do that. 
and he said he needed the one that does this. The other one is slightly different, but yeah, this again, Target clearance. Okay, and I don't know if you guys have noticed now um, with Target clearances, when they do clearances, they no longer do anything like this, like put these, this is a Walmart clearance, but they don't do this anymore where they put the clearance tags on it. You need to go walk the toy aisles and rather than seeing the clearance tag targets as whites, you're going to see the tag where the price is on the shelf. It's going to show clearance. So you guys got to walk the toy aisle now. They don't put them out on a special clearance aisle anymore. And I think that's how I scored so much Jurassic Park stuff this year is that people didn't realize that. So they didn't bother really looking at the tags because they didn't see any white clearance stickers on these. So just a helpful hint. These are two um, Walmart sales. I got these for my great nephew for Christmas. Then, this was an Amazon Prime deal. Again, a, a lightning deal. This is one of those um, Lego sets, and I think it's usually around $50, I'd say. Um, it's 434 pieces. It comes with all these people and makes this whole scene and the baryonyx dinosaur. So it's going to be about $50 to $60 regularly. I think I got it for $18 during the Amazon sale. It was either 15 or 18, I can't remember for sure. It was a while ago with Prime Day. So then this is another Prime Day deal I got for my uh, great nephew. So the learning resources, I love those toys. There have been some of my favorite toys when Jackson was a toddler and we still have some learning resources things. So that's a great company when you can find it on sale especially. So this is actually from, I'd say two or three years ago. I bought these on clearance thinking this would be great when he's older, but I wanted to wait till he was like super into nerfs and it finally happened. You'll see there's two more up there. So I do remember that I had pulled these and scanned them because it said 13 and they were at the time they were actually five. I can't believe I remember that from that long ago, but I remember thinking, man, 13, I'm not going to, I'm not going to pull the trigger on that, but I scanned it to be safe and it was actually cheaper. That happens a lot in Walmart clearance. So even if you see a sticker, still scan. Jackson's elf rocket also stopped by with Santa and he wanted me to pop these things for you guys in the video. This might still be on sale, he said. Walmart had it on sale. It's one of the cheapest um, advent calendars Rocket could find because he didn't have time to make one. And um, it might still be on sale, he said, on Walmart.com. But Jackson really loves Legos, obviously. So this is what Rocket is said he is bringing him December 1st. Rocket also got him two other things. I will show you guys when I get to it. This, <laughs> this Kinetic Sand Kit is from, I'd say probably two years ago. I don't even think the clearance sticker is still on it, but it was like crazy cheap, like five bucks. Jackson loves Kinetic Sand, and I thought this would be great because it's got, it like locks tight, and it's like a travel kind of case but I wanted to wait till he was slightly older like now the reason I didn't give it to him is because I figured like this age he's not as messy with the sand which the sand is meant to be messy but like when he was younger he probably would t just took it all out and dumped it um so now he's finally like uh kind of age appropriate I also have some other stuff I'm holding on to for when he's bigger um that's kinetic sand stuff but I think he'll appreciate it more because he still plays a lot with his play-doh too this, huh, this was an after clearance sale. I think I got it for, I want to say 20 bucks. Um, Jackson is big into video games. He gets to play them on the weekend. He's a little gamer. And so when I saw this down to 20, I um, ended up grabbing it because there was only a few left on clearance. And um, this is like the perfect year for it, I think, finally. I'm going to keep it in the corner. I'm going to switch out his little Melmo chair that's in the corner and put his gaming rocker. And that kills me because he's getting so big in his little Melmo chair. He can't even sit in it anymore. I don't know why I still have it in the corner. But that's where this is going to go. So he has something to game in on the weekend. So I'm really excited to, to give this to him this year. Okay. Whew. Okay. This Santa said he made, and he said that you can also find it at Costco. This is the other thing Jackson asked for. He asked for Nerf guns, specifically dinosaur Nerf guns, very specific, 
and laser tag guns like his friend Max brought over to our house. So um, Santa pulled through. This is a gift from Santa, and he said that he believes he saw it at Costco, too. So Santa's got a little competition because Costco apparently is making them as well. Over here are two more of those Nerf gun things I got a couple years ago. See, some of them were down eight, but when I scanned them, they were all five. So that's why you always, always, always scan. See, this one got marked down. And even if you see multiple marked down stickers, still scan and scan here, not the clearance sticker. Because if you scan the clearance sticker, it's going to give you the price that's on there. Always scan the barcode on the box. So he is going to be a Nerf heaven this year, just loving it. We've got a couple more things over here. So I'm going to kind of like shift things around so I can get to it. Alrighty guys, so when Rocket stopped by with Santa to talk to me about Christmas so I can make this video, Rocket said, you know, with his Legos, I'm also going to bring him some new yard inflatables because Jackson loves Christmas inflatables. And unfortunately, two of the puppy ones he picked as a, like, I think he was 18 months old the first time he picked one, they've kind of burnt out and become beat up. And so Rocket thought it would be a really fun thing December 1st to replace the two that got messed up with two dinosaurs since he is such a dinosaur fan. So that's just a little gift from Rocket December 1st when he returns to us. Um... Then this I found in Walmart. It was actually three. Again, always scan the actual barcode. I think it's back here on this. Um, this, he has a uh, American Girl um, doll. It's the boy. His name is Mason. And of course, he still has sugaris and he loves taking care of his sons, he says. So he he like always plays with the barber's chair when he sees it in like the Target or the Walmart. This one is the Walmart American Girl, but all the American Girl stuff and all the Walmart and the Target versions, they all work together. So it doesn't have to be American Girl. If you live in Houston, check out Tuesday mornings. It's located near Memorial City Mall. American Girl sends the stuff they can't sell to that specific Tuesday morning. Okay, I got a phone call and I don't know if that messed up recording. I hope not. But Tuesday morning near Memorial City Mall, deep discounts on actual American Girl doll sets. I'm going to be stopping there um, probably later this week just to see if there's anything else I want to add to this. Like I said, Jackson's sons, um, Mason and Sugaris, they have to have all the accessories. So, all right. This is another Target. Um one of the Target finds, and it's like the OG Jurassic Park kitchen scene with the raptors. So that's going to be really fun because I don't think he has these two characters from the, the original. This, oh, you guys, I will be honest. See, this is right before they stop. This is the clearance sticker I'm talking about. This is right before Target stopped doing this. So you won't necessarily, I thought they were white and red, but they're white and yellow. You won't necessarily see these anymore, which I'm actually fine with because I hate on boxes like this when it's something for me. Like, because you know I'm a doll collector. When there's a sticker, I have to worry about peeling off. Now, <laughs> Jackson still loves superheroes. And I'm not going to lie, I had a minute where I was like, he has so many. Maybe this is just for me. Maybe I should add it to my doll collection. But I didn't. I'm going to go ahead and give it to him because um, he hasn't quite gotten to Doctor Strange, but I think it'll pique his interest. For me, for me, the Scarlet Witch, like, I love her. So that's why I was kind of like, oh, I kind of just want to put him up there, but I'm not going to because I'll, ha I'll have it when he outgrows it, right? <laughs> so I love the Scarlet Witch. Um, I think it will pique Jackson's interest now in Doctor Strange. He's still a huge Marvel fan. He's finally started watching the movies. His current favorite thing, though, is Morbius. He loves that movie. He's, like, vampire obsessed. It's hilarious. Okay. So this was clearance from Walmart. I don't think the price is on there. It was not $11 when I bought it. I believe it was, like, 5 Um, So it's a punching Jurassic World... Um, bag kind of thing and then it comes with these like boxing gloves like bop things um and I probably would not have bought it for 
$11 or whatever the original price was because I feel like these things pop easily, but for five, sure, of course I will. Um, then he, we got him Monopoly Jr. Um, he doesn't, we try to play regular Monopoly and I think it was just like too long for him. We also have a Toy Story version, but we love Monopoly. But so we thought Monopoly Jr. would be a good starting point for him with his attention span. So this was a Walmart online sale thing, and I think I paid five bucks for the games like this from Walmart. Last two, and then we are done, friends. Okay, so a uh, Rajasaur. I don't even know what this is, but this is one of the ones that roar. It's in a plastic bag, so this was an Amazon deal. I don't know how to make it roar. It's got a button somewhere on it, but yeah, this is one of the, there we go. This is one of the Amazon dinosaurs that was super cheap. And the very last thing is this. This is a scene from the new Jurassic World movie and one of the Target clear outs. So I am now going to return Santa's things. Oh, you know, something's missing. Hold on. Okay, guys. Sorry about that. Um, Santa said he is putting these two hats in Jackson's stocking with some candy, the squishy toy, and um, maybe a couple odds and ends. He says he wasn't sure yet. He was still working on it. I wanted to share that with you guys. And then the last thing Jackson asked Santa for, and he did not clarify. He said he wanted a saber tooth tiger toy. Now, Jackson has a saber tooth tiger skull on top of his toad's tank in his bedroom. And so um, Santa thought that this would be cool because he also loves Power Rangers. So he got him this saber tooth tiger Power Ranger toy. But he said he's also going to find just a small saber tooth tiger figurine just to make sure he covers all the bases, especially because Jackson only asks for three things. Anyways, guys, that is my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in my next one. I'm not sure if it'll be my home tour. I have not yet got one of my trees decorated. I meant to decorate with you guys on my um, channel, like uh, decorate with me, but it, it, happened, it happened that I pulled everything out the week that Jackson had pneumonia, and I was leaving on a cruise, and I was like, I got to get this stuff up because I can't live with boxes just sitting everywhere. So, um, I have a lot of laundry still to do, <laughs> and once I get that kind of picked up, I'll do a home tour for you guys to show you my Christmas decorations for the year. Um, I don't buy a bunch of new stuff. I've bought a couple little odds and ends, but my tour is more just sharing my home, and my, my, my aesthetic is just, you know, Christmas through up, and like decorations I've had for years. Anyways, I'll see you guys in my next video, whatever that may be. Bye!